All right, it's a new day, we're back. Today we are going to be installing a sunroof delete panel from Nelson Racing Wheels or Nelson Racing Design, which is what he's changing to. Uh, this basically just gets rid of your sunroof and puts a nice little panel in it because you're gonna drop a bunch of weight. How much are you supposed to save? I think uh, it's like 35 pounds. 35 pounds? Yeah, the, the glass wow. and the motor actuator and the cassette is where all the weight is at. Pulled the headliner out last night because Shane was like, Let's go to beat up at six. <laughs> oh, yeah. I can't do both. But that thing is only like a pound, so I think I'm going to put it back in just to cover up the side airbags and stuff. Oh, yeah. So I don't die if I put it into a wall. Yeah. Race car stuff, it happens. <laughs> you should have a suit and probably a roll cage. You'd be like that one guy. You're going to run 10. Someone's like, he doesn't have a cage in his car. Someone's going to yell at you. But uh, we're gonna go ahead and install this. It'll kind of be like an installation video. And by that, I mean, we're gonna figure out how to do it as we're doing it. We're gonna it. time lapse it and not give <laughs> any instructions. Exactly. You'll see what, how it goes. How'd you get the headliner out? Literally just pull it down and it comes right um, out? No, there was, so you gotta remove the uh, sun visors and then the oh crap bars and then the, in the A pillar, B pillar and C pillars. And then there's a couple clips, huh. and then you basically pull it down. The removing part, taking everything apart, takes like 15 minutes. The getting it out of the car takes <laughs> like an hour. <laughs> it doesn't want to come through the door? No. I had to remove the whole driver's seat last night to get it out, and yeah. spin it like three times before I figured out something that worked. <laughs> well, all right, that's how you get the headliner. So now we're working on the sunroof, so you need a T30 for these little bolts right here and what a 10 millimeter 10 millimeter and for these looks like a t25 for the motor driver yeah and i so far i think that's all i see all right um, cool. pop the drain hoses out of the corners drop everything disconnect the cable power cable and it should come right out well that sounds easy enough let's plug away at it oh. sunroof is out it really wasn't that hard to do at all and then we got the delete panel right here pre-putting in some of the screws you're going to want to reuse the screws that you took out so don't lose them like you know wheel well or anything like that we like to do and then we're going to throw this back in Next, you need to get yourself what, five quarter inch self tappers right. and you'll put them in through these holes right here, which go into the double layered metal right there and hopefully not your roof. Milwaukee M12, it has a sheet metal screw setting. Oh, really? This is the first time I'm ever going to use it. <laughs> wow. 
Hey, we're good. It didn't go through. <laughs> well, I don't know if it's all the way up. <laughs> but I'll put this on one. Check the top. Yep, you're good. Any denting? No? No denting. What'd that take? Half hour, start to finish? No idea. Wasn't long. <laughs> Not long at all. You see, it actually looks really, really good. It's pretty flush-ish. It's not exactly flush. Right. But in, in the notes, it came with a disclaimer because there's a weather stripping seal in there. And he, Nelson, Stephen Nelson wanted to make it to where you didn't have to caulk. So oh, yeah. That's it said a good optional. Idea. You can remove that, caulk it, and it'll sit flush. I didn't care. Oh, yeah. It looks Great really good. Then on the inside, yep, looks good. Looks like we got to tuck some wires, put the headliner back in. Good as new. Mm -hmm. But hey, saved a bunch of weight. Makes all the good stuff better. And makes the car look really good, too. Carbon fiber, carbon fiber. Right. I like it. Race car stuff. But that's it. Nice quick video. That's how you install it. We'll see you guys later.